Members of a family in Gibsonville are desperate to find their loved one. The last time anyone saw Gwen Collins was this past Friday, August 9th. She is 62 years old. She's been missing for 72 hours, and first responders have been searching in Gibsonville trying to find her. Celeste Smith joins us now live in Gibsonville tonight. So, Celeste, what do we know about this search? Yes, since Gwen Collins was last seen here on Friday in the 6100 block of Bellflower Road where she lives, and it's a silver alert was issued for her, and Guilford County Sheriff's Office along with Fire District 28 have been working with other agencies trying to search for her through drones, planes, and boats and here down on the ground, and her family told me that they hope to find her soon. I love her, and I miss her, and I wish it wasn't like this. Gwen Collins' family says she was in need of her medication and left home without notice when nobody was home on Friday. They were planning to go out for a family dinner that night. She was most gentle person you would want, want to meet. I mean, she'd, do, she'd go out of way, do anything for anybody. Active search crews took a pause on Monday in their search for 62-year-old Gwen Collins after three days of searching for her near her home in Gibsonville. Friday the third and Sunday, they was they were doing a good job looking for. We still haven't come up with a whole lot of stuff. We had dogs on the ground. Uh, they did a lot of searching, uh, picked up on a lot of different scents. So uh, nothing's turned up. The search was impacted by high water levels from recent heavy rain, making it challenging to check out Reedy Fort Tributary. With the big storms that we've had here in the past few days, the water it was where it's normally basically knee high. You were looking at 25 foot deep water in some spots um, just because of the hilly terrain that's in the area. They're worried she may have slipped and fell into the water due to her vision being impaired by cataracts. Guilford County Sheriff's Office said the water levels are still high, which is why they've had to pause the search by boat. The Sheriff's Office is continuing routine patrols in the area. Her family thankful for the efforts. They just want her to come home. She was a good person. I mean, a good person. I love her. With nothing I wouldn't do for. Gwen Collins' family said that she recently celebrated a birthday last Thursday, and they are still hoping for the best. If you have seen Gwen, you should contact Guilford County Sheriff's Office or Guilford Crime Stoppers. Live in Gibsonville, Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News. Our hearts going out to her husband and that family. We hope she is found soon. All right, let's.